Hey guys, welcome to uh, Last Stand Media. This is Tom McDonald and Brandon Hart featuring Nova Rockefeller Church. Like and subscribe, comment down below for more videos and check in the description for eventually we will have a Patreon and an email in which you guys can email us for other things that you would like us to go over. I need a short drink or a long prayer. I've been sober, but I don't care. I'm so scared of my own self. I get no help and that's no fair. So don't go there. I've been hell and back. I got scorched hair in this Gucci cap. I got empty bottles and a million follows. I regret swallowing the Ativan. <laughs> Let's be real. I resent the way that I feel. I pretend that it's cool, but I miss getting drunk. And I'm angry that God doesn't help when I kneel. I said my prayers. When I got clean, it just got worse. I quit doing drugs and I pleaded with Jesus to save me, but he didn't hear my words. The don't work, it hurts. I went to church, now I need liquid courage. Whiskey in my glass, I take the knives out of my back to stir it. Go to hell and back again, then show you burns to prove I earned it. I need shots of God to gain the strength I need. I'm just a person. Wow. Let's <laughs> say he's uh, was having a struggle. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Right, and so I know from struggle. his background, he did struggle with uh, alcoholism and in you know probably other things in there and th this is kind of like that, that a song about him you know finding god and what he's what it seems like in this song that he's saying is right now he's still blaming god for not pulling him out or blaming jesus right for not answering his prayers but it seems he's still saying what he was doing and how he felt mm -hmm. and uh, and you can and and it seems to me the temple of it i haven't heard the whole thing and right. uh, I'm sure we will, but uh, that uh, that he's recognized that it was really on him or, or Satan guiding yeah. him and uh, and his rejection really of, of God. So he starts, I think he's, he's, he's going to take his responsibility for it because he's never going to cure it. It's never going to be cured unless he yeah. does take responsibility. Yeah, for that's the part, that's a, the struggle with people that have addiction issues, right? Not everybody struggles equally when it comes to an addiction issue. Addiction yeah. can be whatever whatever that poison is. It can be yeah. cell be phones. Money. It can power. be money. It can be power. It can be alcohol, drugs, you name it. And however that addiction comes across, you have to you have to resolve that yourself. And yeah. you know through you, your faith, your belief systems, your foundations, you know things that keep you structured. Mm -hmm. Well, the foundation is important. Uh, for all of us, you build a house, I'm a, a home builder, you better put a good foundation in. And yeah. because it doesn't, it might look okay for a minute and uh, for a while, but eventually it's going to collapse. Right. You're going to have a problem. And yep. uh, uh, things don't work. And, uh, and I'm recognizing that, uh, that you need a good foundation, which I'm sure uh, McDonald uh, came came to discover as uh, he reshored his uh and uh because uh, otherwise he wouldn't have been able to beat these addictions that he's singing about because then the reality is is he's trying to help others who are suffering and yep. uh, i'm sure that's the reason for this it's not just a uh, oh woe to me feel sorry for me but there are others he knows that uh, may be struggling mm -hmm. and need somebody to point to the light to them to to be able to escape that this is terrible i, I mean I've, I'll, I'll tell you i was raised around alcoholics yep. and uh and it's a brutal terrible thing and uh, and people don't think anything about it, and a lot don't, and they just kind of ignore it. And uh, but it's it's brutal. It raises havoc, all kinds of problems that would, people would never ever experience if it wasn't for for the alcoholic in their life. And I mean, they have out on for uh, for the family members or loved ones of, of alcoholics, so they know how to deal with it. Uh, but uh, uh, it's it's a it's a tragedy. Yeah. And uh, yeah. And. Uh, uh, and he's really banging on it right here. You can tell he's hitting hard. Mm -hmm. Of course, I haven't heard anything he's done. Not that I followed everything he's done, but I'm certainly, I certainly am liking him as, uh, as he's, uh, he's, he's really driving the point home of where he was at, uh, during this condition and, uh, just how brutal it was to him personally and yep. probably others. Yep. All right, here we go. And show you burns to prove I earned it. I need shots of God to gain the strength I need. I'm just a person. I pray on my way to the liquor store that they lock the door. Cause I'll lay in my grave. If the whiskey pours like it did before, I'm scared. I send out a prayer. Can anybody hear me? Is anybody there? Cause honestly, it hurts. And every day's worse. God, but he don't hear me and my demons are there always listening 
face in the dark, drowning in whiskey. And I went in so far, you say you miss me. I'm on a ship in a bottle, so say goodbye at the shore. Break the glass, so you'll find me. I'm not who I was before. Close my eyes in the darkness and hold on through the storm. I'm a wreck in a bottle, I wasn't built for a war. There's church pews, bright lights, whiskey glasses. Bottles of booze make short days turn long nights. The bottle, the Bible, I didn't know what to choose. Hmm. Hmm. It's interesting the the two topics, right? It's yeah. got the misery and the pain of alcoholism, and then God. Right. And 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 there there's. Even through this, there he knows one is the salvation, the saving grace of it, and the other one is the one that's beating him on the rocks. Right. And uh, uh, and it's uh, uh, it's a tell. I've never suffered an addiction, uh, praise God. And uh, but uh, it's uh, 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 it's a battle, and it's a mm-hmm. battle of wills. You know, the scripture tells us that uh, that uh, God never gives us. Uh, uh, there's not, there's never a sin that he doesn't provide us a means of escape from. And, uh, and the thing is, is being, a, being an alcoholic, uh, that physical activity can, can cause us to do so much harm to others where real sin can kick in. I mean, some right. real sin can kick in and, uh, and it's, 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 uh, it's, it's pretty great that, that, that he's putting the two right up against each other. Because mm-hmm. if you believe in God, you got to believe in the devil. You got to believe in Satan. Yep. And uh, yeah, you're not going to get one without the other because there's there is a Satan. And uh, and uh, uh, and so who's pushing what? And I always say, if, if if things are going really well for you, I mean, truly in a in a pure sense, well for you, is uh, is you're walking on the right path. You're doing those things that are right. But if things are really rough. Is, is that's not God testing you because he doesn't test you. Scripture says that. That's Satan. He's just trying to get you. And unfortunately, the closer people try to get to God, as more Satan turns up the heat to drag him back to him. And that's right. why he's talking about that the demons always hear me, right? Yeah. And, uh, and he needs a shot of God. And uh, uh, is, uh, is the, that, that dichotomy, that, that arrangement he's recognizing, which is good. Yeah. It's, it's interesting. All right. After long nights, the bottle, the Bible, I didn't know what to choose. I pray on my way to the liquor store that they lock the door. Cause I'll lay in my grave if the whiskey pours like it did before. I'm scared. I send out a prayer. Can anybody hear me? Is anybody there? Cause honestly it hurts and every day is worse. still with me my eyes can't see from the bottles of whiskey I don't believe anybody will miss me and I'm on my knees tell me God are you listening Pretty, pretty tough. I'll say this about uh, 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 Tom McDonald is, uh, is he doesn't mince words. No, he doesn't. And, no, uh, he's, 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 he's on really point direct. every time. Yeah. Yeah. I, you know, uh, the truth is, is powerful. Matter of fact, Jesus says, right, the truth will set you free. And the truth uh, isn't always what we want to hear. 
Mm -hmm. uh, especially if it comes to uh, something that we've done or our behavior or whatever. Sometimes we want to we want somebody to tell us something that's not quite as accurate as we know it should be you know, right. about our behavior or something we've done. And uh, and and he's pretty good at pointing that out. Is uh, is uh, is what happens is that God gets blamed because He hasn't saved you from drinking, but you already know what the answer is in his song. He says, you know what the answer is, right? You know, you yeah. need God and, uh, uh, and, that, and that battle. And that just goes to show how strong uh, the demons are and uh, evil is and, right. uh, as we're carnal, we're human, right? You know, we're raised in a carnal world and we understand carnality, but we don't really understand spiritual. We don't pay much attention to it, but our spirit's the driver of the car, which happens to be our body. And uh, whether we feed our spirit to do good or to do evil is uh, a choice, a choice we all have, which actually leads us into a whole lot of the other th the topics mm -hmm. that we've discussed. It's, yep. a, it's a choice. And shout we out to, to and shout out to Nova on the shooting yeah. the video. Um, yeah, good really, job. Really good stuff. And thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe. Comment down below for more, uh, more, more things you guys would like to see. Oh, and and if. If an addiction is your problem, talk, listen to this on McDonald and get down on your knees and keep asking. Because obviously with McDonald, God heard him and answered his prayers.